Hello everybody, it's BlockDuck, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to download and install shaders in Minecraft 1.20.4. Um, so the first thing that you have to do in order to download and install shaders is you need to download a mod called Iris, because in order for shaders to work, you need a mod to run um, the shaders on. So anyways, what you're going to do here is you want to click on um, where it says Download Universal Jar uh, for Fabric, and this is going to be the first link in the video description. So you have to download Fabric, uh, you can click download universal jar right here and then it's going to say fabric installer uh, done now you can just double click on this right here and it is going to uh, launch fabric for you there we go and it's going to say minecraft version 1.20.4 you want to make sure you have that selected um, and then you can click install and fabric will install for you. I already have fabric installed So I'm not going to install it again But anyways, uh, the next thing you want to do is click on uh, the second link in the video description And that is the link to the iris shaders mod and what this mod does is it allows you to use shaders in Minecraft 1.20.4 so you want to click down here where it says featured versions This is the one for 1.20.4 and then you want to click on uh, where it says download right here and um, as you can see, it is going to download Iris for you. Um, there are a few other things we have to do, though. There are two more mods we have to download. The first one here is Fabric API. Um, so it's going to be your third link in the video description. You want to click on this featured version 1.20.4 right here and click download. And it's going to download Fabric API for you. And then the other mod that you want to install is Sodium. And if you go in Modrinth right here, Modrinth is really nice because it puts all these mods right up at the top. So if you click Mods, you'll just see all these. But um, anyways, that'll be like the fourth link in the video description, the Sodium mod. So you can see right here we have it for Fabric 1.20.4. We're going to download that. And um, as you can see here, we have Sodium that is downloading. Uh, so we have Iris, Fabric API, and sodium. The next thing you want to do is you want to actually go ahead and um, pick a shader to download. Here you can just click on where it says shaders right here and from Modrinth. It's really convenient because you can just click shaders at the top and you can just pick a shader uh, to download. Um, or if you have a shader in mind, you can just uh, download that one. But if you are on Modrinth when downloading your shader, which I am, um, this process will be very similar. But um, anyways, you want to pick a shader that you like. So I'm going to go with... Um, the vanilla plus shader right here so i i like the look of this one and it seems pretty simple pretty easy to run so what we're going to do is we are going to download it so to do that we're going to click featured version see all and you want to pick the one that um says 1.20 um the version may not be updated to 1.20.4 but that should be all right you can click download anyways um as long as it says 1.20 um Point 0.1 or 1.20 something that says 1.20 you should be good to go um, So you can see we now have our shader that is downloaded right here So the next thing that we're gonna do is we are going to um, open up Our downloads folder so to do that we're gonna click on um, this little button right here It says show in folder and it's going to show our downloads folder and all of the mods that we have downloaded so from here you can minimize out of this and we're going to open that back up later, so make sure you just minimize out of it. And now we're going to um, open up the search bar of our computer, type percentage, app data percentage. And you want to click on the little file folder that pops up right here. Um, and from here, you want to click dot .minecraft at the very top. And you want to scroll down until you see the mods folder. If you've never installed a mod before, um, you need to just make a folder that says mods, all lowercase, right like this. So you can just click on that. It's going to show all the mods that you have. And from here, what we're going to do is just uh, drag and drop the Sodium, the Fabric API, and the Iris mods um, from our downloads folder straight into our mods folder. Um, and there we go. And now, as you can see, we have Iris, Fabric, API, and Sodium all right here. And now, what you want to do is we are in um, the mods folder, but we have to put the shader itself in the right place also. So, to do that, you want to click where it says dot .minecraft right here. And you want to um, click on where it says shader packs, which is right down here, shader packs. And um, it's going to show all the shaders that you have. And from here, what you want to do is you want to... Go back to your downloads folder and drag and drop the vanilla plus shader or whatever shader you choose to download into the shader packs folder right like that there we go uh, so now what you can do is you can close out of both of these folders 
and you can actually launch Minecraft Java Edition. Alright, so here we are, uh, Minecraft Java Edition. You want to make sure that you have Fabric Loader 1.20.4 selected. Once you do that, you can click where it says Play, and then it is going to load up for you. Alright, wait, so here we are in Minecraft 1.20.4. So what we're going to do is we're going to just um, pick a world, and we are going to click Play and actually log into that world, and we're going to have... The shaders installed for us. Alright, so here we are in the Minecraft world, and you may have noticed something. Um, there's no shaders. But don't worry, that's alright. So, the next thing you want to do is you want to click on Escape, and you want to click on where it says Options right here. You want to click Video Settings, and then you want to click on where it says Shader Packs right here. And now, as you can see, we have all our shaders, so you want to click on the Vanilla Plus. You want to click on Apply. And there we go, and now you want to click on where it says done right here, and you want to click done again, and you want to click done again, and you want to click back to game, and as you can see, we now have the shader installed. Um, so as you can see, that is pretty much all you have to do in order to download and install shaders in Minecraft 1.20.4. I hope that you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to leave a like, and um, if anything... Uh, is it working for whatever reason, or you enjoyed the video, be sure to comment, um, and I'll do my best to answer those. I try to answer as many of those as I can. Um, anyways, thank you for watching, and have a great day.